So while you're browsing, uh, there might be times when uh, certain websites might try to access certain things. For example, you can see that there's a microphone icon right here. If I were to click on it, it says uh, Google.com wants to use your microphone. Allow or block it. So if I were to allow it, then I can speak and then it'll actually go around. And you can see that uh, the speech recognition is going in place. So I can go around and then use that out. Similarly, if I were to go to maps, it'll try to access my location and so forth. And this is totally up to your preference. And to see those settings, you can go around into the three dot icon right here and then you can go to settings. So once you do that on the privacy and security section right here, you can see site settings is an option. So once you click on site settings, you can see that these are the recent activities. So if I were to click on it, you can see that I allowed microphone right here. So motion sensor is allowed, notification is ask uh, and so forth. So all of these features are have a certain level of allowance in certain site. So you can go around over here and then you can enable and disable the permission. Let's say, for example, if some website tries to access my location, maybe I want it to ask first. So if I'm sure that I'm using a secure uh, website which can do nothing wrong with my location, then I can turn it on. And if, if um, the site is suspicious, I can just block it out. So you can go over here and change this. So you can see that you can uh, you, you can see like with sites, it has been blocked in with sites that has been allowed in all the things will be listed here and you can allow uh, allow us before accessing or you can turn this off, which blocks the location entirely. So it does not allow you to uh, go around and enable this for everything because that is very risky in many cases. Same goes for the camera, same goes for the micro, uh, microphone. It'll ask before it is uh, accessing those content. So notification as well, you can go around and then you can go around right here, use quieter notification and so forth, and then manage that out as well. You can also go to additional uh, permissions where you can allow motion sensors. If you're using device with motion sensors, then you can uh, choose whether to allow this or not. You have automatic downloads, ask when a site tries to download file automatically and so forth. So you can go around into each one of them and then click on it and then enable and disable them according to what you like and add and delete the sites that you uh, want to control. You can go to JavaScript right here, which allows you to uh, run different, um, uh, different uh, web applications and so forth as well. And that is how you can work around with the site settings to enable and disable different settings for a website. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.